If you were recently diagnosed with a chronic disease or use infusions or injectables to manage your health, you might be familiar with the term biologic. What is a biologic? Biologics are complex medications that pharmaceutical labs grow from living cells. Because of their molecular structure, biologics can't be digested like pills. The acids in your stomach would destroy them. Therefore, this type of medication must be given through infusion or injection so that it can directly enter your body. Because biologics are grown rather than manufactured, there is no true generic version compared to medications that you swallow, like ibuprofen. If you are on a stable treatment plan and your prescribed infusion drug suddenly changes, you might feel frustrated and confused. Huh? And you might be wondering what this means for your health. Although there are no generic versions of biologics, you may have heard of terms like biosimilars, interchangeable biosimilars, and unbranded biologics. These different terms are important to understand, especially when your treatment plan changes suddenly because your insurance company decides to switch you to another drug. Biologics can be confusing, even for the experts. So let's use pizza as an analogy to help define these terms and illustrate what this means for you. Let's begin by defining biosimilar. Biosimilar means a biological product that is clinically similar to an existing biologic approved by the federal government's Food and Drug Administration, FDA. A biosimilar cannot be substituted for a biologic without your prescriber's authorization. Now, back to the pizza analogy. Let's say you order a veggie pizza with mushrooms, olives, and onions for toppings. But the pizza delivery person gives you a veggie pizza with bell peppers, olives, and onions. It is still a veggie pizza and very similar to the pizza you ordered, but it is not the same pizza. And what if you are allergic to bell peppers? Now, let's define interchangeable biologics. Interchangeable biologics are biosimilars that produce identical clinical results as the original biologic product. Therefore, these biologics may be substituted by your insurance company without your doctor's permission because they are considered clinically interchangeable. This time, you order that same veggie pizza, mushrooms, olives, and onions, and you receive a pizza with mushrooms, olives, and onions on it. But this pizza is from a different pizza parlor, not the one you ordered from. This pizza parlor is new, and you are not sure if you will like their recipe. Now, let's define unbranded biologics. Unbranded biologics are biologics marketed without the brand name. An unbranded biologic is a FDA-approved equivalent to the branded biologic. In this case, you ordered the same veggie pizza one last time. Maybe this time your favorite restaurant will finally get your order right. Mm -hmm. Your pizza is made exactly as ordered, finally. But before they deliver it to you, your pizza is removed from the box that you're used to and put into a different box. Same pizza, same ingredients, same recipe. The only difference is the packaging. So why is this important? Understanding the confusing parts of your treatment plan empowers you to ask your doctor and insurance company important follow-up questions. Like, will this medication change impact my treatment plan? Is this change FDA approved? If not, what are my rights? This is something you can ask IAF. The Infusion Access Foundation is a community of patients united to protect access to treatments that you get at a clinic, such as infusions and injections. We support each other across all diseases and advocate with one voice that reaches policymakers. We are here to help. If you have a question about biologics or anything related to your treatment, please visit our community online.